Tap Tap here, welcome back to Cave Story. We're gonna take a look for that fireplace that was in the Mimiga village. Because if it's anything like the other fireplaces, we can use the jellyfish juice and get an item out of it. I think it was in this building, the assembly hall here. Yep. Yes. Bubbler. I'm pretty sure that's a gun. I forget what it does, Oop. aside from blowing bubbles. And it looks really weak. I assume it gets a lot stronger when it's level 3, but I forget what exactly it does, so I guess we'll see once we're in the sand zone. Try and make sure I level it up. But we're actually about to get another weapon, too, once we go in there. That'd be nice, because we've been stuck with a polar star for most of the time. And if you keep the polar star through the whole game, or through a decent amount of the game, you can you can get trade it for the best weapon, basically, but there are a couple of other points in the game where you can trade it for a different weapon. And I'm about to trade it for something. Oh, who's that? You're as weirdly pale as we are, but we're a robot, so what's your excuse, lady? What's that icon over the door? I guess it's a wine glass. Sand zone residence. Hey bunnies. Hey, random chick. Okay, I know that. Please don't shoot me. That's not nice. Oh, okay. Sort of beat up all of the mini guys. Is she like invincible to the rocket launcher? Oh, I guess she is. Ow. Ow. Oh, our gun went down. And we beat up a random person for not much reason. Huzzah! I really wonder what happens if you say yes, but I'm not going to. Hurley Brace. Excellent. Hmm, that sounds familiar. Why would that be? Yep. This is the first opportunity to trade the Polar Star. I'm like an idiot, I'm going to take it, because I do kind of like the machine gun. You're supposed to wait and... I don't even remember what you do get, but I think it's quite a ways into the game, and I don't even remember exactly what it does, but I don't really care about getting the best weapon. And I got the machine gun the first time, so I sort of wanted to go through the game with it. No, it's kind of rabbit things. I sort of feel bad for shooting them, like, Pretty much every episode, I think I've shot a Mimiga for not too much reason. Though some of them go psycho and try to kill me. Oh, hello, angry something. Whoa. Following me. That's lovely. Oh, maybe these things just go along the edge of the level, I guess. And more life. Oops. Ow. I forgot about those things. They're like giant sand gators or something in the sand down there. So what you want to do is 
So try and travel through these big columns here. I wonder if you can kill these sun things. I guess you can hurt them at least. Oh, they split apart. Uh oh. That was bad. And I can't get that experience because of the stupid alligator thing. Maybe it's a crocodile. I have no idea. Ah! Go away. No idea what the distinction between them is. And a lot more experience all in the sand pit. Wait, is that an item up there? Oh, it's a save thingy behind that wall. Let's read that quick jump. Spikes! I'm not sure if those hurt you or not, but I'm not going to find out. You're probably supposed to go through the middle, but... Yeah, this sort of feels like cheating. Oh, I guess one of them's not trapped. I can just hold the button. That's easier. I'd really like this gun to level up because it's really wimpy at level 1, but it's pretty sweet at level 3. Oop. Hey, I didn't get eaten that time. Let's save over here quick. Ow. Oh great, now I have to do that again. Can I kill you? Can I pet for two at least? I see you crushy thingies. Hey misery, what's going on? Sandworm boss? Or sand bug or something. I keep forgetting I can just hold down the button. That's another sort of nice thing about the machine gun. If you're lazy in the way, which I am. Oh, and it does run out, which is sort of annoying, but. It reloads itself pretty fast, and I need to switch to a real gun. I don't think this counts as a real gun. But we can use it anyway. There we go. Whoa! What the crap? I forgot it did that. I think this is the last boss that I faced on my first time through. So, uh oh. I guess you have to have the machine gun out for it to reload, which that kind of sucks. Oh, and die. That was insane. Whatever. Let's get rid of this guy. There we go. Yeah, this is why I would really like to get my stupid machine gun leveled up. We defeated Omega. Okay. What does that mean? Uh oh. Damn. Why does it keep falling for that? Jeez, I almost did it again. 